Now you guys, today you can see that our baby has grown so very much. She's huge, look, she's just leaning over the pot. All big, huge. And I think it's time for her to go into a new pot. And I'm just going around here so she can just fall out. Oh, perfect, perfect. Ooh, look, all those roots, she's doing good. Can you guys see that? Yeah? everyone welcome back to our channel the soaring seawood family i'm ivy and thank you so much for joining me with plants with ivy if you're new here go ahead and smash that subscribe button ring that notification bell so you can be notified whenever we upload a video today i am super excited because i am reparting our purple passion and if you have not seen how i created this beautiful pot for our purple passion go ahead and check it out i will link the video right above here now you guys today you can see that our baby has grown so very much she's huge look she's just leaning over the pot all big huge and i think it's time for her to go into a new pot but i'm also thinking that i want to train her to trail up oh i'm really really not sure most purple passions as they get huge they become like hanging plants um and i see them in the stores and they just hanging down and they get so so big but i have not hung any plants in here as of yet i usually have them trail up so i might train her to trail up the wall that works best here in our home i am in texas you guys so I know that our conditions are not like everyone else's conditions. And today it is raining. Am I talking too much? You wanna get right to it? Let's get to it, but you guys already know, I have my coffee. I love coffee. And if you haven't checked out our mugs and our tumblers and the things that we have on our Etsy shop, go ahead and check out this commercial. sure to check out Sierra Creations at EtsyShop.com where you can get customized Moment Mugs and Moment Mugs designed by the Soren Seward family. We look forward to sending you your very own Moment Mug. And remember, all you need is a moment. If you're interested in purchasing anything from our Sierra Creations Etsy Shop or you have a custom idea that you want us to personalize or customize, just let us know. Inbox us, leave a message, we'll get right back to you. Now let's get into this plant, shall we? Okay, yes we should. All right, so first thing that I'm gonna do, I have the GoPro here, so in case anybody needs to get like up close shots, you can have that, you can see that. So when I purchased this plant, it was a little bitty plant, you know, some things died off, and it was only $2.94 from Walmart, all right, it was $2.94. Since then, it's had its issues. It wasn't as easy as I thought it would be. I know K-Love, he loves Purple Passion, you guys. If you do not know who K-Love is, go ahead and check him out. He is another plant family, my plant bro, here on YouTube. And um, he loves Purple Passion. But it wasn't as easy for me, but um, it's still pretty, it's doing pretty well. It had its trials and errors, but it's all good. Let's get her into a new home. And obviously I was doing something right I just left her alone because she is loving it. We have a few leaves that's not doing too well, but it's cool. It feels so soft. The texture is so soft. I'm wondering, I'm trying to get it on so you guys can see the texture and how beautiful she is. It's like fur. Beautiful. If you haven't got one, go get one or go check one out at the plant nursery, Lowe's, Walmart, Home Depot. They all have them, okay? So I already watered her the other day, so I'm just going to get right into it. I'm going to take her out. And I figured that now that I'm doing these plant videos, I figured that now let me try to make this feel as real as possible for you so you can get down into see the soil and see what I'm working with. That's why I'm going, um, that's why I'm using the GoPro, okay? So you can get some footage to see what it's like for me. I like to use my hands. I do not use gloves, sorry. If my nails are a little bit gritty and they're not up to par, sorry, I'm really not an 
nail person. Maybe I'll paint my nails next time. Who knows? Anyways, let's get it out. So first thing I'm going to do is squeeze the sides of the pot. You don't want to just yank her out, okay? You want to be as gentle as possible. And I'm just going around here so she can just fall out. Oh, perfect. Perfect. Ooh, look. All those roots. She's doing good. Can you guys see that? Yeah? Wow. Wow. Okay. So, I can probably reuse some of this soil that's right here too. She's already moist. You don't need that. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab a pot. You guys grab your pot if you're following along with me. And I am going to take some of... I have here miracle grow potting mix. You guys know I love my miracle grow potting mix. And that's all I'm going to use to coat the bottom of the pot. Okay? So I'm just, see, I'm just gonna take a little bit and just cover the bottom. That's all. Covering the bottom. That's it. All right? So that's cool. And then. I am just going to break her up just a little bit. I don't want to be too hard on her. And she has some room in here. Let me take y'all in, you see? Um, just see the room that's left in there? See all the walls still have space. So once I plant her in here, I am going to add more soil just so she is snug in here, okay? So I'm holding her upright. So I'm having my hand under here and I'm holding her upright. I'm not squishing on her leaves. I'm not squishing on her stems. I'm just holding her up so we can fill in the gaps, all right? And you also want to loosen up the soil so the roots can breathe. If you don't know, they need oxygen as well. They need oxygen, they need to breathe. So I am still just going around here and I'm pulling from the soil bag, the miracle Grow potting mix, and I'm just pushing down as I go. Filling in the gaps, not being too rough, but being firm enough. Oh, that rhymed. <laughs> Girl, check you out. So, yeah, we have that in here. And that is all that she is going to need, all right? She's already moist, so I'm not going to need to add any more water for right now. As she dries out, I will. And I'm gonna take the remainder of the soil that um, came from her pot and fill in the top. That's all I'm doing. That is all that I'm doing here. Being gentle, being gentle. Don't wanna rough my baby up. And she has a few um, leaves that Look like they're browning on the edges, but I'm not gonna trim those off right now because it's not really a big deal. And you guys, I have under here a tray. This is the tray that I'm using that I also got from Walmart. I didn't paint this yet. Should I paint it? Hmm, maybe, who knows? So, she is all done here. And make sure you have something that's gonna catch the water and allow it to drain. And if you, when you water your pots, when you, when you water your pots, when you water your plants and the water drains through and it comes in here, you need to recheck it because you don't want the plant to just be sitting in a bunch of water. You don't want the plant to ever get root rot. So come back about after 30 minutes after you have watered your plants and dump the tray. The water that's coming out, dump the tray and toss it you don't want it to sit in water you know if you sit in a tub you'll get wrinkly you just keep getting wrinkly you don't want that to happen to the roots okay all right she is all done look at her in her new pot showing out being all beautiful yes it's done Thank you guys so much for joining me on Plants with Ivy and Repotting the Purple Passion. I really had a great time with you guys. If you have any comments and concerns, drop a comment down below and I look forward to our next plant video. 
I have some plants that I'm excited to share with you and I will be redoing some plants here and just switching up some things because I need to show our plants some attention, okay? They have been getting left behind in this quarantine. All right, you guys, until next time, stay blessed, stay true, and continue to be you because the world needs more people just like you. And if you're not feeling needed, remember here on the Soren Seaver Family Channel, you are needed. Catch you guys next time.